In this video, I want to show you how to test responsiveness uh, using Google Chrome uh, to look at what the website looks like in different size screens. So uh, what I'll first do is I'll show you what happens when I resize the browser window. And so I'm resizing it down. And you can see that as I resize it, dynamically things change on this website because it is a responsive website. So the menu now shifts to up here. If I keep scaling it down, this uh, sidebar shifts over to the side there. And now it shifts down below and actually disappears altogether on this website. So now I get to see what it looks like on a small mobile screen, on uh, a tablet, and uh, on a computer screen. Now, if we want to edit this, uh, I'll use Google Chrome Developer Tools. So press F12, and that brings up the, the toolbox. Uh, go to the Elements tab, and then as you begin to change size, you'll notice that it says up here that the dimensions of the window you're using right now. So that gives you a clue as to when the changes are happening. So here at 1138 pixels, the menu appears. Now let's say I'm not happy with how the menu bar here is black. I can now use the developer tools. I click on this arrow. I select this element. And here I can see the, the CSS code that says this is to be black. Uh, I can uh, give it a, a try straight away on the fly to, to change it to a different color. And uh, once I've found a color that I'm, I'm happy with, maybe something like this, I can make a note of the code. And uh, then I just have to go into the, the CSS file. So in this case, I'd go into this file here next to CSS on the on the server. It shows me where it is on the server. Uh, and I'd simply add in this line of code. Background equals and this code here. That will give us then the new color. Uh, and uh, I'd also just note that this code is from the, the website itself, from the page. So there is some code on this page that is defining that the menu is to be this background color. So if I can find out how to change it on this page, then I'll go into the code and change it on this page. Otherwise, I'll go into the CSS file and add in the line defining the background color as I want. So, um, and if I want to, I can also navigate through the different parts of code here, uh, seeing what is happening regarding the, the menu itself, uh, and the CSS involved in it and changing that as I want to. Now Google Chrome also has one more tool that I'd like to show you which can be quite useful. So click on the toggle device toolbar and that will then enable us to see what it looks like on various screens. Let me just disable this for a moment. I can see what it looks like on the Galaxy S5. I can see what it looks like on an iPhone an iPad, etc. Uh, I can also determine what resolution I want to look at it with. So this is just another tool. Now, it mightn't be fully accurate, so uh, it still pays to check directly on an iPad or an iPhone or a Samsung Galaxy, but it gives you a good indication of what it might look like for a mobile phone user. So uh, in this uh, tutorial, uh, we have looked at how to use Google Chrome Developer Tools to examine uh, a website uh, in various sizes, testing out the responsiveness and potentially checking out some changes we can make to the CSS to adjust the way it appears.